This is Derrick Henry. King Henry is one of the best running backs in the entire NFL. But today in Madden 23, I'm going to make Derrick Henry a 0 overall and try to upgrade him up to a 99 overall. This is how Derrick Henry is going to be able to earn upgrade points. For every rushing yard that Derrick Henry records, he will actually get 1.5 attribute points. For every 1 receiving yard that Derrick Henry gets, he will actually get 2 attribute points. If I happen to win the game that we're playing, that will be an additional 50 points. And any touchdown that Derrick Henry scores is going to bring him the most points by giving a whopping 100 points for every touchdown. I have to give a huge shout out to the creator of this type of video series for Madden, Kenny. He makes great videos like this one. Did it with Patrick Holmes and a number of other great quarterbacks. Go check it out. This is a zero overall Derek Henry with the lowest possible stats that you can make in Madden 23 with everything lowered to one overall. Now, Madden won't actually let anybody go lower than a 12 overall, so that is the equivalent of a zero. However, just like I did for my Tyree Kill video, I'm going to allow Derrick Henry to get 50 free points to start off with. So the first two things I'm going to start off by upgrading is going to be a speed and acceleration just so he's not zero speed slow. And with my remaining 16 points, I went ahead and put that to catching just in case I need a quick catch from Henry, maybe for a touchdown. Last thing we need to talk about is that before every single game i have one wheel spin to spin for derrick henry this could either include a multiplier that we could use in game for like double yardage points 1.5 touchdown points or just free points to spend before our next game to make derrick henry better and going into our first game we could give him any 99 stat that i want and the stat that makes the most sense right now is going to be his speed i'm going to make that a 99 overall that way if we could just get a little bit of space maybe get to max speed he can fly i'm going to be using a lot of these halfback stretches because getting to the outside maybe giving him enough time to actually get to that 99 speed is going to be our best chance at actually getting him yards but i'm thinking for this game just like i did with tyreek in his video we're gonna have to just get derrick henry a ton of touchdowns to start off with because he's not gonna go anywhere we didn't pick up one yard so i'm gonna need this titans offense to get me to the goal line as much as possible that way we can go ahead and just give derrick henry like one yard runs maybe get him in the wildcat just run right up the middle something like that just hope for some good blocking and hope for a lot of touchdown points in this game. Gonna hit Austin Hooper here. What a throw by Tannehill. But sadly, he was out of bounds. Let's see if Austin Hooper can get open. Or Phillips. Get to the one. Get to the one, Phillips. I don't know. We're gonna score from the four-yard line. We are about to find out. There's nobody up the middle. If we can't score right now, we're never gonna score. Derrick Henry! He's in! And we actually got four yards, which I'm impressed about. Can we get him up to that 99 speed? He actually picked up five yards six yards we got thrown for maybe an extra three but i will take it six rushing yards he might be close to like 10 yards i think he is close to 10 yards might be over 10 yards and look at henry picking up another two pa crossers is going to be our best friend play no i got hit at the last second and we're picked off Something I haven't tried yet would be a screen. Okay, where Derrick Henry had no awareness right there to even go out for the screen. Wins are also super important here, so I have to make sure we get them. What was that? That should have been caught by our player. Can Derrick Henry catch passes? He definitely can run routes. But I gave him 15 catching and he drops it. I'll give it to him though. The blocking looks good. Oh, but he can't cut it, but he does pick up a yard. They're going goal line though. That's not good. Oh, that is not good. Is there a chance of him running the slant route and actually catching this football? Oh, he dropped it, Derek. No. Real quick, everyone, before we get back into the video, only about 4% of the people watching this video right now are actually subscribed. If you're enjoying the content you're seeing, make sure to subscribe to the channel. But let's get back into the video. And I just get one big play. Burks, open. Trail, I need you to go all the way to the one. Oh, I can't believe I'm tackled. I want to get the touchdown with Henry, but I got to be smart, too. No, oh, I'll take it. If we can win, that's fine. Let's try a screen pass. Will he go out on a screen pass? Derek. He caught it. Oh, my. Derek Henry caught the ball. I can't believe that he picked up 14. He still didn't look like he had 99 speed. That excels too low. We're looking at like 200 points or so right now. If I had a guess with the yardage, if we win the game, if we can get one more touchdown, we'll probably have like 300. Henry's wide open. He caught the football again. And he picked up nine yards. Henry, I'm going to give him the ball. Derek. The last few plays with Derek have been crazy. Derek Henry might be a better running back catching the ball than actually running the ball right now. Derek, get in the end zone. No. No way. I cannot believe that just happened. We're going to lose this game. Zero seconds. We lost. 
So Derek finishes with 21 rushing yards and the one touchdown. And then he also had 21 receiving yards. And here is a breakdown for the upgrade points after game one. So I'm going to use 70 of my 174 points on acceleration, making that an 88. And then I went ahead and I used my remaining 104 points on his agility and his strength, putting them both to 53. Sadly, that still leaves Derek Henry at a 12 overall. Back to the wheel of multipliers we go. And I'm not going to lie. I am a little angry that we did not get that 150 points we would have for that touchdown and for the win. But it's okay because we have touchdowns that are going to be worth one and a half points this time around. So a touchdown will be 150 points in this next game. This is going to be a much tougher win against Buffalo, but I am curious to see if Derek looks a little bit better. Oh, he looks good. Oh, he's going to be able to run the ball. He looks much better with that Excel and that agility up. Can you pick up the full 10 for us, Derek? Derek Henry, his biggest run. No doubt about it. Derek Henry for what, 24 yards right there. I guess that's a good thing if you're upgrading a running back instead of a wide receiver is that you don't have to do route running, release, anything like that. Just speed, excel, and agility. And he can look this good already at a 12 overall. He is shredding it. Derrick Henry comes out of the game, though, because that problem is going to be his stamina is still at a zero. I haven't upgraded that at all. So that's going to be a problem. That's a nice catch right there by Phillips. I call the timeout. I got Derrick back in the game. Come on, Derek. I need touchdowns from you. They're worth one and a half Bang! points. And Derek Henry's in. No fumble at the goal line here. That's 150 points. We are going to have a big game. As cool as it is to see Derek Henry shredding it right now, I have to be smart and make sure I get as much points as possible in this game and take advantage of the one and a half points for the touchdown. If we can get it here, though. Little RPO. Derek Henry, please don't fumble. We are first and goal. I want to give him the ball, but I don't want to fumble. I'm going to throw it instead to Robert Woods. I feel way more comfortable at the two. Come on, Derek. Get in there again. One and a half points for the touchdown. Get that block. Get that block. I got stuck on my own teammate. And now they're going into goal line. I don't know if I like my chances here. Oh, they ran commit, and I had no chance at it. I got to play for the win, sadly. So I'm going to kick my three, and we're going to take the lead. Derek Henry has just crossed 50 yards rushing for the first time this video. We'll see if we can get him a touchdown, which I desperately want. Austin Hooper, that's a good catch for a lot of yards. Get to the one. Operation, get to the one. Hooper. Nice catch. I'll take it at the five or the six. Every time they're in goal line, though, I'm not happy about it. But the middle's wide open. Just don't fumble, and he couldn't get in at the one. This is at the inch line. Please, Derek, get in. He's in, Derek, for another touchdown. That's a huge amount of points. Let's see what you can do, Derek. Can you get outside, Derek? Derek's having some huge runs today. 78 yards as a 12 overall. We find ourselves back at the four-yard line with a touchdown possible. Derek, get carried in. Do something right back to the line. I'm not letting him get in goal line. I do not want to see them in goal line. Come on, Derek. Get carried in. How is that not a touchdown? And now they're in goal line, which I'm not happy about at all. Oh, Derek. And he's not in. They're going to remain in goal line, but I have to go and try for this. No way! He's not in! You've got to be kidding me! The whole middle was open! So I'm going to have to come up huge here with a first down. We have one. And go down at the one! No, don't go in the end zone! No, but I'll take it towards the win. We have this game in the bag now. 25-10, three minutes left. But I want Derek to get another touchdown. Can we swerve him out of his boots? Derek stays in bounds, and he's in the end zone. That is a heck of a touchdown for Derek Henry. That is an early season highlight, and I'm going to show you guys. That is on all pro. No freezing, no cutting of the gameplay here, so you know it's on all pro, and you can't change it inside of a franchise game. And with that crazy touchdown by Derek, we get three touchdowns on the day. We win this game in Buffalo. We go from a very bad game one to a monstrous game two for King Henry. Unreal. Derek Henry, 126 rushing yards as a 12 overall with three touchdowns. Here is a breakdown for the upgrade points after game two. So I used 103 of my 689 upgrade points from game two to max out his acceleration, his agility, and his strength. Then I use 450 more points to upgrade his awareness, carrying, vision, brake tackle, trucking, stiff arm, change of direction, spin move, and juke move to 51. That left me with 136 points. I took 34 more of those points to add to his catching, which will leave me with 102 points. And because we had 102 points left over and I wanted to start catching the ball out of the backfield to get us those times two yards, I gave him 51 short route run, 51 release with three medium route run. We finally went up in overall, but we still have a lot of work to do from a 12 to a 38. Now we head back to the wheel of multiplier slash free upgrades to see what we are going to get here and we are going to get a receiving yard multiplier of 
times two yards. And that spin on the wheel is absolutely huge because receiving yards were already worth two times the yardage points. So every receiving yard we got was already worth two points, but now they're worth four points each. So just a 10 yard reception is gonna be worth 40 points. So that is gonna be absurdly good for Derrick Henry. But can he catch the question? And he can for a 19 yard pickup. And that's already 76 points in one catch. We're gonna try to keep everything nice and short though because he doesn't have any medium or deep route run. I have to go to Derek here. Can he get one stiff arm? He doesn't have enough stiff arm yet for that. We send him on a little wheel. Will he look slow? He does look slow a little bit, but once he gets to that full speed, Derrick Henry, what a catch. He looks slow coming out of the break because of the release and the route run. But then once he got to his max excel and his 99 speed, he could be dangerous in the passing game. That's a huge pickup. Even with a possession catch there, he drops it. Get it to him quick here. Oh, this, no, he still doesn't have great strength. Don't go back for six. Good tackle, Tannehill. I am not having a great game with Tannehill right now. I think I've thrown like three or four interceptions. But we got lucky with whatever happened with that pass because Derek got a catch. I could go for the field goal here, but I'd rather have the Derek Henry catch points. That's fine. Can we get a spike? Can we get a spike in time? We can. I think Derek has to be either close or over 100 yards receiving. If he made that catch, that would have been crazy. Can we start this half off with a huge play to Derek? Come on, Ryan. Good throw. Good catch by Derek. And he stays on his feet. And then he's taken down. Can Derek come up with a huge catch for a touchdown? It's going to be open. Can he walk in? He gets leveled, but at least it's a first. They're actually not in goal line. Come on, Derek. You got to get in. It's wide open. That's Derek Henry. That's vintage Derek Henry. And just like that, we are back inside the six yard line looking for another touchdown for Henry. I want to say this is probably our biggest point total game so far, especially if we get this 100 point touchdown and we're carried in the end zone. I think this is probably going to end at this drive right here. Could be wrong, but you never know. Oh, Derek. I got to take the chance at it. Derek. What? A oh, he dropped it. Derek. Right up the middle. Give me a block, Phillips. Good try. Derek. Right up the middle. For 51 route running short and medium at three. He looks pretty good. It's got to be that 99 speed and acceleration. Can he get another touchdown? He has another. We could have won this game too. This is by far our best game. Well, sadly, we didn't win that game. We lost at 24 to 21. However, we're going to start with the rushing stats of Derrick Henry going for 64 yards and three touchdowns. But that is nothing compared to the receiving numbers that Derrick Henry had 235 yards. Here is a breakdown for the upgrade points after game three. So we have a ton of points to spend, but checking his stats after that game, they actually upgraded some of his stats, I guess, because he had a really good game. So I used 455 of those points to upgrade all of those following stats to a 99 overall. Then I went ahead and I took all of his catching stats and route running stats, maxing them out at 99, which leaves you with 395 points. Then I took 74 points and put it towards his jumping. Then I took 138 points and put that towards his pass blocking and his pass block power. Then with my remaining points, I made his stamina and toughness 80 and his injury 26. Let's see what overall that makes him. That should be a huge boost. A few moments later. And those boosts are good enough to make Derrick Henry a 99 overall. That's going to do it for the video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor. Hit the like button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. In the comments down below, let me know what challenge, what video do you want to see next. Peace.